I think I've restored my cockpit back to sanity. Let's see if I can get this this uh, phone mount adjusted again. Try and give y'all a visual that's not just my bicycle wires. Okay. Yeah, so my my handlebars were tilting around. That's what was going on. Get my lid back on here. Now my helmet's all foggy. I'm going to have to keep my visor down up first. Try and let it clear up a little. So yeah, I had to make an emergency pit and fix my handlebars. Thank goodness I carry a pair of Allen wrenches around. I don't know if that's a lack of um, thread grip. Like maybe I need to get some blue on there. Or if, uh, if maybe I just didn't tighten them down to the proper torque when I put the handlebars on. But man, that was creepy. Probably I didn't torque the handlebars enough whenever I attached them. And eventually they rattled loose. But still, a little bit of blue thread holder might help and I might go ahead and look at it once I get home and redo it again because of you know there's a chance these handlebars were twisting around inside of the, the thing a little bit and it might be stripped so I might just be screwed I might have to get a new headset and new handlebars and everything I'll have to look at it better later I certainly hope that's not the case but anything that can go wrong will go wrong and now my mirrors are all screwy because of I'd been you know you gradually adjust them when you notice, you know, you think that maybe they're just rattling around. When really, your entire headset's coming undone. And, and you didn't even realize it. So that's, that's a fantastic find. I'm glad I found it now instead of later. Alright. Whatever, man. I'm just going to ride down to the river and then probably go home. I'm a little nervous now. Something don't, it don't feel right anymore. Get out here and nearly averted disaster. <sighs> nearly avert one disaster or another, right? It's what we do. <sighs> it's what we do. Scooby Doo. Whew. Plus, my back has been hurting lately. I think I've been riding a little too much. I'm at 558 miles now. So, I put a few miles on the bike. Just a few. Yeah, the headset feels right again. So, that was probably part of the weird, funny feeling I was having. Damn, I'm glad I caught that. So my clear face shield won't come in until the end of this month, like almost the new year. So I may not be doing much more night riding once it gets a little colder. Right now my visor is up completely because that's what I have to do because it's so stinking dark. And without a clear visor, I might be limited to not doing any more night rides and it gets nighttime so dang early. <sighs> It's just unfortunate, sucky circumstance 
Oh yeah, my back is killing me. I noticed my back was hurting too whenever I was using the Allen wrenches to tighten down the headset. Every time I tighten a little bit, my back hurt worse. So maybe I've been taking too many bumps to the spine on the bike. I haven't been doing much more than bicycling and a little bit of house cleaning, so it's got to be hitting too many bumps, I think. <sighs> too much riding. Is there such a thing? There might be. I think I've just about found out. I think I've screwed around and found out the answer to that is probably yeah. Yeah, when you're 46 years old, you might want to be careful or get a I'm thinking about getting a seat cushion like uh who is it who has the seat cushion on the guy with the colored stickers the bungee cord that keeps his uh, bag together and um, he's got a red aerial rider I think it's a 48 volt can't remember the, his name right now awesome dude he's got Shinko's he's got Shinko 244's and uh, he's got a racing uh, thing on his forks like if you're a BMX racer dude's awesome I like him a lot um, what was my point do, do, do. give me a second to think I had a point I really honestly I did I know I know I was making a point here what, what was the point I was trying to make I'll probably have to replay the whole stinking video and get my train of thought because it's gone whatever I I forgot the thought Hang on. What was it? I forgot the thought that I was thinking. I think if I thought if I were smart, I'd get a rock and a what is it? Get a piece of string and a rock to wind a string around. Everybody wants a rock to wind a piece of string around. I think that's what I was getting at. I think it was something about a rock and and, and a string to to wrap around a rock. I think I think that's the point I was making. What was it? I forgot the thought that I was thinking. Anyway. How about that? How about that? That must be the answer. That must be the, the thought I was thinking. I thunk. Woo! Too much riding. Oh, seat cushions. Seat cushion. Dude's got an awesome seat cushion. Um, the uh, the Shinko 244 fella. The red bike. Anyway. Yep, yep, yep. Very nice seat cushion. Maybe that's what I need for my back. When my back started hurting again, I remembered what I was talking about, didn't I? See, it didn't take long. I knew there was some kind of relevant point. Just had to spitball long enough and figure it out. Whew. There was a point to be had, ladies and gentlemen. kind of the problem with being a people pleaser is uh, when you're a people pleaser and you like to help people like I do you kind of um, you know whenever you're helping somebody you're so focused and you're able to think and get through their problem and, and help them through it and then whenever you're not solving a puzzle for someone else it's like that's recreation time so like your brain zoos at your ears I guess and your laundry don't get done, your dishes are dirty, and your desk is a wreck, and uh, and yeah, and you can't hold a coherent thought because of you're not helping someone right now, so it's free time. And during free time, who needs to who needs to think deep? You know, you're unwinding, and that's how it goes when a cow trips over a friend chicken XD. That's all I'm saying.
It's so beautiful. I so like riding this bicycle. I can't go back yet. Don't send me back. Anyway, at the start of uh, the earlier video where I probably wasn't recording, I mentioned my wife is uh, over at my daughter's house taking care of my grandbaby so my daughter can get some house cleaning and other chores done. Because the grandbaby, believe it or not, is like a very quiet grandbaby. So whenever she cries, she sounds like it's the faintest little sound, like a like a goat. And all she, she goes ba ba, and unless you're listening, you're not gonna hear. Her. And she's got strong lungs and everything. And I'm sure if she goes in, you know, like a lot of discomfort. She could call out a little louder. But um, typically, very 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 quiet grandbaby. So good. She is good and adorable. I might go ahead and attach a picture of her to the to the video. Man, she's awesome. Marceline the Vampire Queen. That's my grandbaby. It's a little wet out here. That sucks. Because the leaves. You got to believe in leaves. They will make the ground wet. After it rains, it'll keep the ground wet. Which sucks. And sometimes the hills block the wind in such a way and the sunlight where the roads just don't dry off. Be careful in the wet. I'm not wearing my I'm not wearing my pads, so I'm being kind of dumb. It makes me just a little nervous that there's all these little wet patches here and there. <sighs> Gonna let that back wheel slip out from under me again and hurt my elbow again. Hello, rabbit. Are you home or what? Here we go. Oh yeah. Pretty, pretty freaking wet and sketchy. Maybe a crash and make some good content. You guys keep on missing my crashes. I have yet to get a live crash on camera. It's because if I don't follow the rules. <laughs> the number one rule, the rule Batman taught me. Always be recording. Always be recording. Well, I suck at that. Sometimes I'd be recording though. Right now, I'd be recording. I'd always be recording? Nah, I'm not too good at that. At that black magic. So, Batman did get one thing right. Or at least Lego Batman did. I went on a rant earlier about Batman. It was so funny. And part of the reason why I did that too is because uh, my daughter's fiance, he digs Batman. He's all about that bat life he is batman okay don't don't screw with this dude he's he is like the closest you'll ever get to batman my my future son-in-law um he's a badass dude don't fuck with him Not to say I'm overly afraid of him or anything. He's a great guy. He's awesome. If I could totally get my my ass kicked by Batman, that's all I'm saying.
Hmm. Yeah, it kind of sucks when your back hurts. You like, you're overly careful and crap. The train's coming. Hear that? Hello, train. I'm in the clear now. You can get on with your bad self. I didn't have no train lights over here. Now, I do hear that train whistle, though. It's like, where are you at, train? Roscoe Pico train. <laughs> yeah, the handlebars are much better now. Surprised I didn't know. Maybe I did notice it because I kept on adjusting like my camera mount. I kept on adjusting at some other stuff here and there. Not realizing my handlebars were dipping. Man. It's messed up. Hooligans unite. I guess there goes my video game. I've been out for a while now. I always play it later. Who needs sleep? Sleep is for the weak. Sleep is for the weak. Don't forget. Lesson of the day. Need more time to ride your bike? Sleep is for the weak. Need more time to spend with your wife? Sleep is for the weak. Need to learn how to fight with a knife? Sleep is for the weak. What else rhymes? Help me out here, guys. Comment below. Need to learn how to play dice? Sleep is for the weak. Need to eat some beans and rice? Sleep is for the weak. Make a whole damn song out of it. That's what I say. We got all the time we need because sleep is for the weak. My back won't recover right because sleep is for the weak. My dang arm ain't healed right because sleep is for the weak. I cut off my big left toe with a lawnmower because sleep is for the weak. What else? Gave myself cancer somehow? Nah, that, that has nothing to do with sleep. Cancer sucks. Cancer is the most inexplicable bullshit on the planet. If I could get rid of one thing, if I could do a Thanos snap, there wouldn't be any more cancer. We'd be done with that crap. It is foggy. I don't know if you guys can see the fog billowing in the camera or not. That's probably why the sky looks so bright. Because <sighs> the fog has landed. So earlier, like the reason why the Batman video is so short and such a short little video compared to my normal vlog, is man, I was just ranting. I was ranting about work the whole freaking time and I'm like, this is not good content. And then uh, somehow my mind slipped into Batman. That was the only good part of the ride. The rest of the ride was crap. I'm telling you, I couldn't even focus on the ride. I was so stressed out over work stuff. So I decided to dump. 
quite a bit of footage and just be like you know what that's not good you know I wasn't like being an asshole or anything like I said I abstract stuff a lot whenever I'm vlogging but that vlog ain't gonna help me not in a tangible way to post it anyway do 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 was not good content was not did not pass quality control QC did not get the QC sticker policeman policeman doing whatever the police can can they stop all the crime they sure can't not enough time hey there look out for police man if you are homeless don't let the police search your tent because they need a warrant If you are homeless, you'll never hear that because you probably don't have YouTube. The reason why my mind slipped over the homeless people is because uh, there's stealth campers along this. I know they're out there. I've I've wandered into them on accident a couple of times. There are homeless stealth campers along this Pigeon Creek Trail. It just is a thing. Or maybe it's just people camping out to see the fantasy of lights. That could be it. We're gonna we're gonna pass through some of the fantasy of lights without paying a dime because of the bicycle trails right next to it. Like we won't be able to see the whole thing guys, but it's an entire light-tastical fantasy. And technically the bike trail is still public property. So I don't know, like, I don't think they're actually allowed to film the fantasy of lights like from their cars, so I could get in some trouble here. Maybe I'll, I'll uh, edit this part out or something, but I think I already posted a video with some of this. I may just have to eat the violation or whatever. We'll see. I don't know the rules. I do not know the rules. I think it all just depends. People walking through. Ooh, they've got my trail blocked. Be a little careful through here in case any stragglers decide to walk the trail tonight.
didn't know is a whole pedestrian thing this year. Usually it's cars driving through there. I guess because tonight's so warm, maybe people just decided to walk the park to see the lights. Because I think they only charge for cars. So that could be the thing. I, I say it's warm. It's 50 degrees. It's not really warm. I'm kind of wishing I'd worn some heavier gloves. Hopefully you guys can see something. I'm looking at my phone. I don't know if I'm getting any video at all through here. It's a little dark. Grant, my light should be illuminating. Anyway. <sighs> what does it mean? We're gonna make a pit right here. Should probably turn off my light. Yep, we're making a pit. Okay. Old, but I'm slow and I have to pee a lot.